Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, today I'm bringing you another favorite video and that is how to speed up your LG G5. Now this is similar to some of the steps we always take on speeding up device, but for every phone, it always slightly changes. So let's get right to it. If we go into settings, we're going to swipe all the way over into general, swipe all the way up, and go to about phone. From here, you're going to go into the software information section and you're going to hit build number repeatedly. Hit it about seven times and then you will get, you are now a developer. So from here, we're gonna go back and then we're gonna go back once more. And now we have a new section open to us, which is developer options. So in developer options, you go into it knowing that, hey, be careful, because if you do anything wrong on here that you don't know how, what you're doing, you will mess up your phone. All right, that being said, we're going to swipe up and we're going to go under the drawing category. And in the drawing category, there are three things that say animation and scale. And you're gonna change all three of those things who say instead of one X, you're going to change them to 0.5. So we're gonna tap each of these, change to 0 0.5. What this will do is it tells your phone, hey, I know you take a second to move around, but you can actually do that in half a second. And your phone's like, oh, I can. Well, then I'll just move quicker then. You want me to move quicker and just move a lot faster than I was before? Now I can. All right. Now, the second thing is going to be to remove any of the built-in bloatware that you have no use for. So you're gonna hit the settings button and first go to edit and uninstall apps. Now, if you go to here, you're gonna see a couple of things with some X's on there. Now, this is kind of deceiving because you can actually uninstall more of these, but LG doesn't let you know that. So let's first get rid of the ones we don't need. So I don't use Evernote, I'm all about Google Keep and I'll just hit uninstall and it'll uninstall that app. I'll swipe over and I can see uh, the other apps which uh, comes with it. I personally don't use Quick Memo Plus. I uh, probably will never use it. So I will take that one off. Again, I'm all about Google Keep, which is funny, right? Why would you give me two uh, note-taking apps to start off with LG? Just give me one. Um, and then you have your remote, you have your weather, you have LG Health, if you use any of that stuff, and you're just gonna hit the check mark. Now, important to note, you can also uninstall the built-in bloatware from Google. So if you don't happen to use any of them, you can uninstall these as well. Although again, I don't like that it kind of deceives you and doesn't let you know that you can uninstall this. So how do you get around that? Because I wanna get rid of Lookout. I will never use it, and it's just going to seriously uh, slow down your phone. So you're going to go into settings. You're going to go to general and you're going to go to apps. From here, under apps, you're going to go to the one that we had mentioned, which is Lookout. So from Lookout, we will tap right here and we will tap disable. This will disable it and make it from running in the background, make it from using your cache, your RAM, all of that good stuff. And so your phone will be much faster now without that on. So that will now no longer run the background. Now there are certain steps to improve the battery life, but we will be going over that in a separate video. So if you wanna check out that video, make sure to look at that. But now your phone will be much faster than it was before you started this. Thank you as always for watching. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy.